to show you my dad's irrigation system for my mom's garden. As you can see right here. This is a cheaper and effective way um, than sprinklers because sprinklers can damage the, the um, leaves of the plant, but this um, irrigation system, uh, it only um, gives water to the roots of the plant. This kind of irrigation system is called drip irrigation system, and my dad designed it himself. It's cheap because it uses a 10 foot PVT, um, PVC, I mean, and, and for, it's two dollars for every 10 feet. It's effective because it saves water, and if the, if you um, compare it to a sprinkler, a sprinkler will damage the leaves of the plant and waste water. This is the pump that my dad uses to. Uh, to, for his, irriga his irrigation system. It is a submersible pump. This is a car, um, torpedo pump. Uh, it pumps up to 1,500 gallons an hour. It uses the power of two fluorescent light bulbs, so which saves um, a lot of energy and, and that means it saves natural resources. I am going to show you how to hook the pump up to the hose. Um, and one thing, uh, because the pump is submersible, it stays on water, um, which means nobody can see it, nobody can steal it. Okay, I already hooked the pump up. Now I'm going to put it in the river and then um, put the wire into that small grate there. Okay. As you can see, the pump is underwater. Um, that white thing, do you, do you see it? Yeah, I think you see it, yeah. Okay, now we're gonna hook it up. Okay, I just wanted to um, show you something. It, this is a time, uh, the timer. You can hook uh, the plug up to one of these and then, oh, Open this and then set it to 15 minutes, 30 minutes, um, however you want it. Uh, but we're not going to use the time for it. It saves electricity uh, um, and, and water. Because we don't need like 50, um, 1,500 gallons of water to plant the, the, to plant, the, to water the plants. <laughs> Now I'm going to clean up and see if the, the pump is working. Okay. It's turning. Okay, so now we have finally gotten it to work, and now water is coming out of the pipe. Um, of winter, 
so now it's just a matter of controlling the balls. Uh, okay, all you have to do is poke um, holes that are six inches apart and then put a ball right here. The ball controls how fast and high or slow and, and, and low the, the water comes. Let me show you. So, if you were to put at maximum, it would, it would go off the, the bed. So, I would plant bed. But if you did like this, no water would come. So, you have to find just the right um, height and, um, and quickness that, 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 that uh, controls. There are two reasons why you should poke the holes right on top of the pipe, not below. Okay, number one, uh, the river contains um, sediment that if the holes were to be poked under, that means it would get clogged. And number two, uh, if, if uh, the pipes are clogged, you can just use something um, thin enough to poke the hole. system is that all the pipes are connected, not glued, so that when one gets broken, like right here, see, you can just replace it with new one. Turn the water off so you don't waste water. Then un connect it, and then wait for it to stop. time the the water might freeze and break the pipe so all you have to do is take it off just like I did and then replace and then put it somewhere so it does not break. My dad actually buries these pipes um it's about uh two to three um inches deep and it all leads over there to the big pipe. Um, so when you close one of the valves, the other one will go higher. So you have you have to make all the valves um, balanced. Um, so one does not get more water than the other. Let me show you around the rest of the irrigation system. These are for the strawberry plant, and we just need to adjust the valve. I can challenge. Uh, now I need to. Uh, okay. Good. At least I think it's good. As you can see right here, there are um, connectors to pipes that used to be there, but my dad took them off. Right here are the old pipes that had holes, and we can use them to replace the other.
put it the ones that got broken. So this is the main pipe. It leads to the river and it's um, two inches. And then this pipe over here is one inch. Skinny approves. Over there in the river, you can kind of see the pump. It has been 15 minutes already and there's already puddles of water. Uh, so 15 minutes means 350 gallons of water. In the future, we will show you more about building the irrigation system. Uh, 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 but now, my dad wants to move the lawn to make the garden look beautiful. I'm Izami. I'm Aiman. And thanks, thanks for watching this video. video. Please like, comment, subscribe, and watch my other videos on my channel. Thank you.